Martin Tyler here. Alan Smith is alongside me. We're having the time of our lives at this World Cup here in Russia. Today, it's a round of 16 game that we're bringing to you from Nizhny Novgorod. World Cup action for you live. Special action too. It's Argentina against Denmark. We talk about the highest level that a player can achieve. Alan, you had the honour of playing for England. And we've got two national teams here today. Oh, it's always a special moment when you pull on your nation shirt. Always a big game. This is no different. One thing to look out for from this team today is the way they try and win the ball back within seconds of losing it. Yeah, and they don't do it individually. They get backed up by a teammate. They hunt in packs. And you've got to do that. You've got to do it with discipline. Denmark lineup. Kasper Schmeichel starts in goal. Andreas Christensen plays with Simon Kerr in central defence. And today it's just the one striker in the side. Angel Di Maria. That's good support play from his teammates. Manega! That's a good header, just wide. Yeah, he did time it well there, but unfortunate. Proper tackle that. Ericsson, the shot's on. He's blocked that well. Now we have a corner to come via that deflection. Aguero, they scored. And they've gone into the lead. And undoubtedly deserved. They have been by far the superior side. And they really imposed their will on the opposition. Too good, really, for the defending. And the shot in the end, far too good for the goalkeeper. It was almost an air of, well, we expected this when the goal was celebrated. Nothing too extravagant. I think they know they're the better side and they expect to win. No, I think they do. There's a certain swagger to their play. Uh, and in a self-belief, they know they're better and they're showing it out on that pitch. Really getting at the opposition this far up the pitch now. Angel Di Maria. Aguero. And they have scored. And they do lead now by two. And they've worked very hard for this. It should get them across the line at the end of the match. We'll see. Well, for a fraction of a second, Alan, I thought he was going to keep it out. He did get a touch on the ball, the goalkeeper. But in it went. Yeah, he's annoyed with himself there. He's his own harshest critic and feels he should have done better. Argentina awarded the advantage here by the referee. Looking... Messi! Great move, great goal. Oh, talk about a dramatic appearance there from the substitute. Brilliant goal from him. You don't get away with that when you're a goalkeeper at this level. No, rush of blood, and that's not what you want from your goalkeeper, and it's cost his side. doesn't get past the first man neatly intercepted Vaz he looked to be maybe too precise Alan yeah I think so instead of just getting some power behind it tried to be a bit too clever from close in you like from Ericsson from the set piece there's a little game of cat and mouse and the Dane comes out on top 
What a great goal that was, Alan. Well, he's so threatening in those positions, and it's not a fluke. He does it so often. Taken with great aplomb. Wonderful goal. And there is the final whistle. On they march into the World Cup quarter-final. Well played. Yeah, well done. They both the luck once or twice down there, but I think in the end they were the better team. Sergio Aguero has been brilliant in this game. Well, so often we think of his creative abilities, but a couple of goals here won the match for his team.